Now to a Western Mass News follow-up. Back in October, the Connecticut Attorney General wrote a letter to Massachusetts cannabis retailers asking them to remove their billboards from Connecticut highways. And now that request is becoming law. Western Mass News reporter Amanda Callahan has more from one local pot shop impacted. In October, a letter was sent to seven Massachusetts cannabis retailers asking them to remove their billboards from Connecticut highways. And now a bill that received final legislative approval in the Nutmeg State will ban out-of-state advertising for cannabis products and services, turning the removal of billboards from a request into a requirement. We will be following the law for sure. Canna Provisions in Holyoke is one of the seven Bay State retailers that now has to take down its billboard. Owner Eric Williams tells Western Mass News while he plans to follow the new law, he does not agree with it. It flies in the face of government. Governor Lamont wanting to cooperate with other governors. It fall, flies in the face of regionalism, of cooperation, and you know, it also invites retaliation. You know, at what point would uh, the other states that border Connecticut start doing the same thing that Connecticut did, which was limit commerce across state borders? Williams says that these new restrictions are concerning as Connecticut is also working to build up its own cannabis retail, which is expected to begin operating in the state sometime this year. I think that this will have a much broader negative effect on um, um, on cooperation amongst the states. You know, it's a hypocritical thing for them to do. Like they're clearly advertising, you know, for gambling and for, you know, gambling is advertised all over Connecticut. So, you know, see those kinds of things. It's in, in this fear-based legislation. It's, uh, it's disappointing to see. But he says he is not too concerned just yet about the impact this will have on his sales and customers with or without the billboard. It will also be a very, very long time before any shops in Connecticut can compete with us on price, on quality, on quantity of product. It'll be a very, very long time. And William says that they haven't been contacted directly for a deadline of when that billboard needs to come down. Reporting in Holyoke, Amanda Callahan, Western Mass News.